Well, it's Saturday again, so working on the Civic Day. Today was not an exciting day, though, so you uh, really wouldn't have cared to see what we were doing. We had to do some, um, uh, not really mechanical things, but, um, well, here's what we had to do. Um, see that door crank right there? See how it's all grooved and sweet? Well, same things on the other side. That's not what came on this car. To go over here to my blue Civic, you'll see this one, which is actually better than the other side. Um, these are the window cranks to crank the window up and down. Um, they are stripped. Um, the other one is completely smooth around here. There's no grooves at all. This one has a little bit of grooves less, but not much. And what it is was I had to swap them from this Civic to that one because, well, you got to be able to roll your windows up and down. I mean, uh, it's just a must. Um, so we had to swap them today, and it's not a really fast i mean it's a fast job after you like get it down i mean after you've like taken a couple off and put one on and screwed around you can do it in about 10 minutes i mean like you know putting one on um but so you have to uh the, for some reason the passenger doors only had two bolts in them but then you have like this one this has to come off um, there's one behind there one there and it's like a whole mechanism that goes in the door here that holds the window up and pulls the window up and down. And it's uh, not the simplest thing in the world to do, but I had to replace them on the other car. Um, we was going to put the back seat in today, but it is um, the day before Halloween and they're having like a safe trick-or-treat thing in my town today and then the actual Halloween thing tomorrow so uh, my partner had to leave and um, we couldn't put the back seat in but that's not a big job it takes a good five minutes to probably do the window cranks did take a minute so we went ahead and done them today not real exciting sorry um, I, I have to do you know unexciting things on my Civic to make it right. It did cost me 500 bucks, so there's things on it that's not perfect that we have to fix that's not really car audio related. So sorry it was a boring weekend, but uh, always making progress on it slowly, um, one day at a time. And um, sorry I didn't have anything exciting this weekend. Um, I actually um, have to re-deaden those doors um, because they look like this one again. They have the big holes in them, uh, which is which is completely fine. Uh, I'm gonna switch the deadener on them. I had a mat or a, like thicker deadener that um, was actually would not have been legal um, because it would have been too thick, and I didn't want that anyway. So I was fine with yanking those all off, and I'm gonna use my thinner style deadener that I put on the roof to fill those holes in to make sure everything's completely legal. Because if I'm doing a legal car, I don't. I don't want to screw around and cheat on the freaking doors. Um, so, uh, sorry it was a boring weekend. Wish I had the exciting things on the Civic done, but got to do this other bull crap too. But, um, hey, happy Halloween. Hope you guys have a good, uh, good safe, happy uh, Halloween tomorrow. If you have kids, right on. I got a five-year-old who is going to be six next week. So, we'll be out doing the Halloween thing. I'm uh, going as Grizzly Adams, can you tell? I wear my costume all the time. Yeah. But, um, hey, thanks for watching. Being patient. The base will be here eventually. See ya. Well, today was fucking boring. And uh, the day's over, but the nighttime's here, so we're gonna do a minute of nighttime backseat put in with my PIC 
partner in crime. What up, dog? <laughs> and, uh, no back seat. I painted some black to make shit look better. And, we're gonna do some shit. Well, another successful night with, uh, more shit complicated uh, more than it should have been, but there's always missing pieces because when people take cars apart and then sell them, they pull pieces apart that shouldn't be. I don't know. It's complicated, but anyway, the back seat. It's looking like a damn car. Check this piece out. That's the back, uh, the back little piece fits right in there. I could actually hide the system in here pretty good if I wanted to, but, uh, I'm not going to do that because those seats are going to be down. Oh shit. Boop. Chilling in a front seat that's not even attached. Like a villain. Can't even see down there but that's where the spare tire goes. If it was daytime, you'd be able to see that greatness. But, looking like a fucking car again, except for uh, the front seats aren't in because I got to order that carpet, but that's got to wait. Damn leaves. But, uh, I think I might uh, bring my amp out here and see where a good uh, place for an amp rack will be. Fucking progress.